So it started with this spoon golf ball thing, and then I built pretty much everything around it. Uh, this domino is going to be suspended on the string, which I will light on fire, releasing the pendulum, uh, knocking these dominoes, setting off a, a chain reaction down here, knocking the little bell through, and these dominoes knocking this board off, which should release the spoon of golf balls, sending the golf balls down through the delta and on to the next game. Oh, far out. <laughs> Okay, so if this goes as planned, the dominoes will knock the tape off of the table, which will pull on uh, this little screw and wind it up. As it winds around, this little girl will come around and spank the hedgehog, which will then go down and um, you can note it as a tooth, um, and pop the balloon. The balloon will then uh, release the rubber band, which is holding this weight on a pulley, should swing around, knock you into the boot, which will then kick over the domino. <laughs> this is from North Carolina. This is the Raleigh Rally NASCAR. <laughs> um, <laughs> fan safety has been a bit of a problem, but the idea is the dominoes will fall down. I have lever arm here. Hopefully the motor needs to be running. It is battery powered, but with the weight on it right now, it cannot get up the hill. As the ramp comes up, he'll be able to come up and over, complete the race course track at the finish line here, and we'll knock these dominoes over. Okay, so these dominoes are supposed to go take a right turn. <laughs> this domino is going to fall on the floor, which is going to pull out a, a Pat Boone Greatest Hits uh, <laughs> vinyl. I'm going to have this light that's going to be turned on. There's a solar cell underneath. The wires go over there to a motor, which is going to pull the golf ball away from that donut magnet. <laughs> and then there's a series of oppositely polarity donut magnets. Um, but he worked hours. Well, hours it's, on. It's, 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 that's the iffy part here. Or should, <laughs> we may, hopefully we'll hit a ping pong ball, uh, some small dominoes at the end, one of them tied to a string. When it falls to the floor, we'll gain enough uh, kinetic energy to pull this domino out from here and let this thing start turning around. Then that fork will spank that marble and go over and hit the next table. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Half an hour later. <laughs> okay. when, this, when this domino falls, it should complete an electric circuit which sets off the alarm clock, which hopefully causes a vibration that causes the big marble to, <laughs> prayingly, right, to hit the xylophone going down the ramp, momentum should take it up long enough to hit the small marble, which will go down the two ramps, hitting another large marble, which will gently roll down the ramp and move the lighted candle under the string, which should release the clown's foot to kick the next dominoes. Wow. When, <laughs> when these dominoes fall, they should stretch out the spring a little bit. There's a razor blade underneath the doll's head. Um, <laughs> it should cut the string, releasing the tether ball. The tether ball will swing, knock over this cup full of marbles, which will fall into the tin can down there. Um, that will raise this can up, which will knock the golf ball into the other golf ball and knock the dominoes. <laughs> which will then knock over this domino, which will start this reaction of tubes that will go up the hill, um, knocking the cone, which has the marble perched on it. Uh, marble will go down, go down the xylophone, hit that domino, and go over to the next table. Which will hopefully, uh, this is like the musical bridge of the piece, it's just a vamp. Um, it's dominoes all the way to this car, and then dominoes to a little bit of a non-functional visual flourish here, if it works. <laughs> and then over here, uh, an air switch that we built in class, actually, um, which is no longer activated by air, but by the last domino, hopefully. <laughs> um, that domino will release this marble, which hopefully will seesaw this cork out, um, dropping in rice, which is going to fall in a pan poised to dial. Um, use Don's cell phone to call mine. <laughs> Here, mine will vibrate and um, knock the stainless steel ball. Um, the stainless steel ball, actually, when it hits the metal part, it'll actually complete a circuit, play you a little tune for its ride, and then hit you into Don. And this will hit a nickel here. This is a coffin bank. A hand will reach out, grab the nickel, slide the quarter <laughs> over here, yeah, slide the quarter is. onto aluminum foil, which will then complete a circuit, which will start this car going. 
this way. That will then eventually pull the pin out of the Mentos launchers here. <laughs> <laughs> and you will have a Cook Diet Coke and Mentos grand finale. <laughs>